Hi everybody, this is Crossword Vanguards. I'm the captain here, and this is a thumb that you suck on like a. Welcome to the second edition of the thumb, where we here at Crossword Vanguards will talk about some of the things that we're into right now or not so into right now, and kind of give it our thumbs up or a suck thumb, uh, depending on what kind of. Um, you know, what kind of review that we give to the item in question that we're talking about. Now, I know you guys are expecting Cup Fight 95 to come out here. 95? Yes, it's 95. Uh, I know you guys are expecting Cup Fight 95 to actually come out at this time, but due to a clash in scheduling on my part, um, I wasn't able to get uh, Cup Fight 95 out in time. So I have to push it back to next week. Uh, I'll try to get up on Tuesday, or if not, I'll get back up on Thursday for sure. Uh, but basically, we've just celebrated the holidays here and we've got our rest, we want to get back to work but my work is actually not letting me uh, finish Car Fight 95 in time so I hope you guys understand. Uh, in the meantime, to make up for it, I'm actually doing this thumbs video as you guys can see. Uh, at the same time also, I can kind of tell you what to expect coming out. Um, you know, it won't be a full-on spoiler but you know you can expect myself, Brian, and two decks that has been screaming for support for a long, long time. I don't know why I did that face. Now last time, Dempster actually talked about the cutouts of the um, the fighters' dice that Busher is releasing for Carfire Vanguard sometime in July or August that's coming out from there. And Dempster will still be doing a review of it, but I'm going to take the opportunity to actually use the thumb and actually review something that I'm kind of into right now. And what I'm into right now currently is... I just need to get it light up. Legacy Wars, Power Rangers Legacy Wars. Now, Leon and Dempster actually have gotten into this game um, sooner. The game has been out for about two months already. I believe it was released in late May. And I didn't really get into it because of space issues. And I was still playing Injustice 1. Not Injustice 2, Injustice 1 at the time. So I really didn't have a lot of space for this game. And finally deleting Injustice 1 because Injustice 2 come out. And, you know, Injustice 2... It's not really that fantastic in my own regard, but that's a different thumb of another nature, whatever the, the saying is. But yeah, I finally got into Legacy Wars and uh, I've been playing it for a week straight. And I have to say that the game is actually fun for me because I come from a background of uh, Power Rangers. When I was very, very young, I watched uh, Money Morphin Power Rangers in 1995. It came out. Yeah, so I've watched it and I've grown up with it ever since, all the way up to. Time Force, uh, but then they passed over the rights of Power Rangers to Disney and a lot of mess goes up and I missed out a lot so um, but yeah I'm more of a nostalgic Ranger fan I'm not big on Super Sentai because I never heard of it until I've met Leon who've talked about Super Sentai more than he does, he does Power Rangers so in any case Legacy Wars is basically a 2D fighter uh, whereby you pit your team your leader and two assists against another team's uh, leader and their assists and you basically uh, fight it out in a rock, paper, scissors style kind of combat mechanics uh, to beat the other opponent and advance higher in the, your score or whatever you want to call it and such. And the game is uh, simple <laughs> to, to, to fairly say. The game is actually quite simple because you swipe left to right to, to get close to your opponent or to dodge your opponent's attacks. Or, and then you use your leader's uh, four attack skills that they have. Every leader is different. And uh, your 2 assists is there just to help with your leader give additional attacks to that matter and other things that I've got to struggle to get out. <laughs> but yes, oh, my hair is on fleek. But the game does come with its flaws, namely its reward system, whereby you get morph boxes or loot boxes that you get, and those things actually take like 3 hours, 8 hours, 12 hours to unlock. For each of them and you can only lock one lock box at a time so it gets really really frustrating to, to get these things unlocked because you want to play the game constantly play the game but then uh, there's no point in playing because you don't have quests to do and there's no motivation to, to just sit there and continue playing while you wait for the lock boxes to unlock but that is a mobile game and that's how it works uh, I, I get that that much but you know it'd be nice if there was a way to to take down the lock box timing or let us unlock multiple boxes at one go but this is not a series that discusses how to, to fix the thing I'm just here to tell you what I think about the game so is Power Rangers Legacy War a thumbs up or a suck thumb well if you are a Power Rangers fan just like me uh, I'll definitely will give it a thumbs up because 
they have a lot of characters in there. Some and it's a nice range from from old and new. So you've got the original Mario Mario from Power Rangers to the guys they came out in the movie as well, uh, which the game uh, release actually coincide with with the 2007 movie Power Rangers. And you know I've been playing it for weeks straight. So. Yeah, I've been enjoying my time with it and you know Leon and Nemstar are noticing that I've enjoyed my time with it as well and they're like super happy that all three of us are playing the same game together so we can talk more together. Not that we're really not talking together as if we got So yes, it is a thumbs up. Uh, if you're not a Rangers fan, uh, it'd probably be a meh because of the system in play. The combat is simple but the reward system depending on how you take it is actually either frustrating or something you can overlook uh, because you know the game is simple and easy to, to get into and all the other jazz and such. So that is my thoughts on Power Rangers Legacy Wars. Uh, let me know what you guys think. If you guys do play it, let me know and let me know what you guys think of the game. Uh, if you like the thumb series, then do give this video a thumbs up. Uh, like this video, share it with your friends, and also subscribe to us here at Crossword Vanguards for more shenanigans from us here, car fight Vanguard related stuff, buddy fight stuff, and Yu Gi Oh stuff, and all that other stuff. A lot of stuff I said in the last sentence. And also follow us on all of our socials. We're on Facebook, Crossword Vanguards, we're on Twitter, Crossword VGS, we have a blog, CrossworldVanguards.com. Uh, do join us on Discord, we can check with us uh, almost every night. We're there most nights, uh, myself, Leon, and Dempster. And also, if you like what you see here on uh, Crossword Vanguards and want to support the show directly, you can support us over at our page. <laughs> you can support us on Patreon and help us out over there. So, so with all that said, thank you guys again for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!